Good morning out there. Hey guys, today, my name is Felicia Banks. For those of you that do not know me, I am an advisor for Avacare. We are a world-class health and wellness nutrition company, one of the best in the world, because our products are over in all locker rooms, all professional sports, because of our staple of approval in health, which is informed choice. We actually choose to test for over 200 bad controlled substances because we want to make sure what you're putting in your body is the best. But I'm going to move forward and I'm going to tell you guys a little bit why you're getting this video. It's because I decided to take my health back. And for those of you that know me, I've been an athlete all my life. For those of you that don't know me, but you've been an athlete or you've been a little bit more active and we're getting up in age, our body changes. And what happens is when you life goes on. I gained over, I was 50 pounds overweight going to the doctor. I was forced to take my health back and that's why I'm doing this video. For those of you that don't have health issues, let's keep it that way. For those of you that do, let's work towards having a better you. It's never too late. I was actually that person, worked all the time. I'm down 63 pounds off of the products within eight months. And what I did doing so, I started Avacare. Not for the business part, but I started because I know that my health was horrible. Anywho, today, moving forward, this is my fourth 24-day challenge. In between your 24-day challenges, while you're resetting your body, getting all the toxins out, getting to your ideal goals and your weight, making sure your energy stays up because the 24-day challenge is not for people just that just want to lose weight. It's for everyone. All of us are getting older. Our bodies are changing. So we want to make sure that we're pouring in the good things to get the bad things out of it. With that being said, even with exercising and dieting, that's not enough. Supplementation bridges in the gaps of your nutrition. 24-day challenge, moving forward. I'm going to say that one more time. But today I'm doing my 4 24-day challenge in the process. I continued on products. But I wanted to walk you through day one. I think this is very important because sometimes we get so busy or the person that invited you to watch this gets so busy that it's hard to walk everybody step by step how to do a 24-day challenge. But don't fret. It's very easy. The first thing that you want to remember is your 24-day challenge guide. This is your Bible. This is your instruction. This, for the next 24 days, is going to walk you through and make the process very simple. And if you can read, you can do the 24-day challenge. If you're a busy person, if you have time to grab a bottle of water out the refrigerator, the 24-day challenge is for you. This book gives you from A to Z what to eat, when to eat it, how to snack, what to, to avoid, the supplementations that you must take, and in the very back, your grocery list. Those people that are out there, I don't know what to eat. This is not a diet. There are only a few things that we encourage you, okay, to stay away from so that you can get the better results. It's totally your choice. The number one thing that I tell people in anything that you're starting out, change your mind and you can change your life, okay? That first step to the 24-day challenge. The first thing that we're going to do is we wake up in the morning, we take our spark and we take our fiber drink. This is important to me. I personally like to shake a keep a shaker cup on hand or a bottle of water because it makes it a lot easier. So I personally as well, I add a scoop of my spark. A lot of people do it individually. I add my spark and then I add my fiber with it because the most important thing is that you do not let this fiber sit. If you let it sit, it will get thick on you and then you will be mad. Okay? Because you have to get this down. This is essential to your 24 day challenge because this right here is going to start you to use in the bathroom correctly. And even those of you that don't have that problem, there's a bad way to use the restroom and a, a good way to use the restroom. Dietary stuff of fiber is very good for your digestive tract among a lot of other things. So you shake it up and I'm going to drink it right here from in front of you guys so you can know what to do. not so bad. Once you get the fiber down, you want to drink water behind it. I added water in so I can get all of my fiber out. I'm going to also drink more water 
But my next step, guys, if you look on your 24-day challenge guide, your spark, your catalyst, your fiber drink. And now I'm going to do my two omega plexus. And I'm going to do my catalyst. You can do three. For breakfast, you can do three for lunch. But me personally, I like to do two, two, two. Two for breakfast, two for lunch, two for dinner. Makes it a lot easier so that you don't forget. That is the beginning of my 24 day challenge. The first hour, you want to make sure you eat breakfast. I know that is very hands and face to face on, but I want to make sure you guys don't get it um, messed up how you do the process so that it makes it that easier for you when you're getting started. Once you do that, you get that out of the way. I'm going to drink a little bit more water while I'm done, but I want to be cautious of your time. Once you do that, you want to eat breakfast. My breakfast this morning is going to be my meal replacement shake. Sorry, I lost my earring. My meal replacement shakes. I choose this because sometimes I don't like breakfast and sometimes I don't have time. So this here, shake it up in a bottle of water and go. If you do not have time to do a lot of things in the morning, this is a great route to go. They are normally purchased in the second phase of your 24 day challenge, which comes with your bundle. But I personally get two boxes because I want to start on day one to make sure I don't mess up. As well, meal prepping for your food. Um, you want to get things that you can uh, cook today and make sure you can have things portioned off three to four days for, at a time so that you're not making bad decisions or when you're leaving home, you're not making bad decisions. If you can afford it, get another box of shakes. We also have Avo bars, things you can take on the go. If you don't want to shake, maybe you don't. I personally like to switch it up. So I have my DB9 bars. I'm going to my pantry for one second so I can show you guys what these look like. And we have a lot of different bars that you can take. But the Alvo bars, these are absolutely my favorite. They actually taste like oatmeal. But in a nutshell, that is day one. And at the in, in the middle of the day, I want to make sure that I'm snacking every two to three hours between my meals. Nuts, almonds, nothing with high sugar in it, nothing with high sodium in it. Stay away from the things that are going to cause you to... You're going to be cleaning out your body, but you don't want to add bad things in it. And if you have questions, get back with the person that invited you on the call for your, your pills tonight, your herbal cleanse tablets. These are the pills here. You want to make sure that you put these by your toothbrush or your bed as well. Don't forget at lunch to take your catalyst, your omega, and at dinner time, take your catalyst and your omega plus your herbal cleanse tablets. Also, do not tr try not to eat after 8 8.30. If you're going to be up at least an hour to two hours after that, okay. But don't go to bed on a full stomach. This is also when I'm going to incorporate my sleep work. Sleep is very important. I'm not going to go into detail because I've already took up enough for your time. So if you could afford if you have a problem with sleeping, you have a problem probably with some other things going on in your body. So sleep is very important so that your body can repair itself. The next thing, spiritual health. While you are taking your 24-day challenge, while you're on these products, I always say a part of health is your spiritual health. If your mind is not right, you won't operate correctly. You won't make right decisions. So get little books like this. I have Joyce Myers. I have Joel Osteen. And every single day, if you're a person that don't spend time with God on the, on the daily basis, take five minutes. Thank him for allowing you to have a better day than yesterday. But I'm telling you guys, while you're on these products, you will notice a big change even in your attitude. And I'm praying over you, all of you that are under me or, or with people that I've actually signed up. You're in my prayers because spirit Spiritual health is the most important. So get you some books like this because it helps with your, your mental capacity as well. Also, people that read are very intelligent. Sorry about that, guys. Okay, one more thing. I dropped the thing. Very unprofessional, but it happens. Okay, the next thing, the last, last, last thing that I want to encourage you guys to do, even if you have not been doing it before, start walking 30 minutes a day. Walk and talk to your girlfriend on the cell phone, your, your guy friend. Do some exercising because what that'll do is personally, I personally 
uh, got so overweight that it was almost, it was very painful for me to exercise. So I started walking 30 minutes a day. That really and truly helped me to get back on track. And now I'm running about three miles a day, plus doing some weight, which is to my next thing. Invest in, in you some things like, this is a weight ball. This wall is about eight pounds. Get on the floor doing commercials while you're watching Scandal and Empire or whatever you watch or your, your ESPN like myself. Get on the floor, do some push-ups, some sit-ups, some crunches, throw the ball up. Do different things with it. I also have some exercise videos, so uh, make sure you subscribe the channel. Get things like this. Today, with my 24-day challenge, I'm going to start um, using these weights while I'm in the house, calling customers, doing extra things, walking to the mailbox, walking the dog because I'm doing this full-time. Advocate has allowed me to do this full-time um, and replace my career that was very stressful so I can stay at home and I can exercise while I'm sharing hope with other people. I pray that if you are a person that really wants to continue with Avacare, not just for 24 days, I pray that you think about getting a discount because the discount doesn't require you to sell, but it does give you that discount on your nutrition so that you can save money while you're getting healthy again. Continuously, guys, 24 days is not enough time for you to get yourself back to where you need to be. And if you are the person that say, you know, what? I want to do it, but I'm struggling with finances. You were me. I was also struggling because I helped someone else and I got out of the tent. I had to pay $10,000 to the company I was with. I also had no time freedom. My time, 12 to 16 hour shifts, being working in corporate America, helping others, but I was miserable in the end. So I had to make a change and I was in time debt. Avocare gave me my freedom back and my health my income, and also my time debt. Now I have time to minister throughout the world again, and that's why you're able to watch this video day, today. Get back with the person that invited you to watch this. I pray and I hope that we can be a help and a blessing to you, whether it be in help for your health, whether it be in help with your finances, or whether you want to get back home to your family a lot more. God bless you. Team Fifi, I love you guys. I hope this video helped. God bless. Please share it. Share it with other people. Love you guys. Team Alvacare. Bye.